Radio Perfect Day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kings and queens, and to all my gender non-conforming people. Hey guys, welcome to the Naifu Podcast. I'm so excited. You probably can see it in my face. I am with one of my favorite gospel artists, one of my mom's favorite gospel artists. This is an honor. This is a huge one, Mr. Betusalem Thing. Welcome to the podcast. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Can I just touch you, Jay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Yo, if you want a hug, that was the name of podcast. That's me, bro. I got a hug from there to Slim Thing. I'll never forget this. Um, welcome to the Nameful Podcast. How are you? And not just in the, you know, general reflex. I'm okay, way, but mentally, right now, where are you? Ah, uh, no, man. I'm okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm very okay mentally. Yeah. Uh, I'm strong physically mm. and uh, spiritually. I think I've mm. uh, grown so much mm. uh, now, and uh, I'm glad to be here. Mm. I think that's one of the things that makes me mm-hmm. uh, so much excited and happy mm. is to be here, especially in this podcast. Oh, thank you so much, <laughs> man. I really, appre- oh, I really appreciate it. Again, I'm a huge fan. Mm. Um, you know, so we gate crashed this whole summit. We were not invited, but we saw an opportunity and we were like, some of, you know, um, the greatest people in ICT are going to be here. Yeah, so why not have yeah. conversations? Why not... Um, you know, go out and listen to people and their stories because there yeah. are a lot of young yeah. entrepreneurs who are here. And so I, I bumped into, I didn't bump, but I was upstairs and you were speaking there, okay. right? Yes. And I was, yeah, I was, I was sold, you know? And I felt like you really represented um, just the way the digital space is and yeah. as a young content creator and someone yeah. who's passionate about yeah. the creative arts I was very moved to to just you know be consistent you know yeah. and not sleep on Facebook yeah. for example because <laughs> I don't even use Facebook so I was very encouraged but no man use what you have here yeah. yeah. NYDA or yeah. something yeah. like yeah. that so I really do want to thank you for that it was um, in I, I think generally uh, things are changing now to be more digital yeah and now uh, the digital world uh, is giving us platform to mm. use uh, these spaces so that we may make our living mm. you know uh, you know there are people who just live out of being YouTubers. Yeah. They create content, do vlogs and all those things on YouTube and make a lot of money Mm. out of that, you know. And now with South Africa being a a one of the countries that has a highest number in unemployment, Mm. I think it's good to attend summits like this that will open our minds Mm. in how we can make a living out of uh, the things that we have, Mm. you know. You know, before, I've never imagined that a, a, a TV would be made simpler like you are doing in this podcast. True. You know, this is a whole TV setup, it is. but yeah. now it has been made simpler mm. than before. You know, mm. uh, we've used the analog uh, systems mm. to record our music, hence it was very expensive uh, to record. But now people can record their music on their laptops, on mm. their cell phones and create a professional sound sound, that will sell millions, Mm. you know. And also you don't need to be signed under under (laughs) any... um, Record label. A record label. Now you can distribute your own music in your own space. And we've seen how digital space is able to make the whole world Mm. uh, uh, into a very small circle box, you Mm -hmm. know. Uh, Recently... Uh, Chris Brown released a song mm. featuring featuring you know and uh, I'm sure they've never met uh, physically mm. but because of the digital space and and and, the, and how people are using the creation mm. in the digital space mm. it has made them to meet and it has made them to work together and it has changed the girl's mm. life forever you know mm. uh, there was a, 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 another another um, 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 this guy uh, who does also R&B who, who featured one of the artists John, John, John Legend, Legend. Yes. Yes. yes so now uh, those are possibilities mm. that we need to preach to young people 
that, use your Facebook, use your TikTok, use your Instagram, use your Twitter. Not to go there and be rude and, yeah. and insult people and and do anything that is against the law. Mm. But you can use that space to earn a, a living, mm. to have, uh, to make money, to For make yourself, millions. Yes. You can use that space to also connect with people internationally. Mm. You know, today I'm a nominee in Texas Gospel wow, and sure. Awards. Wow, sure. you know? It's only because I've used my Facebook to influence the whole mm. world, you know. I was able to push my song, you know, uh, before it was it was played on radios, mm. before it was on TVs. I pushed it on my Facebook platform and the song became number one mm. on iTunes, became number one song on Spotify. Song of the year. And it was recognized worldwide mm. by, uh, by digital distributors of music, you know. So... Uh, it won a song of the year mm. without getting so much without and, a uh, record label without a re- record label I was, I'm doing everything myself I've created my own small team uh, I work with my brothers I work with my other guys mm. who are able to help me in terms mm. of uh, creating content mm. you know so um, that way you can also regulate Maliako yes, uh, yes, I'm, I'm, cutting exactly mm. now I'm, I'm able Whatever that I get, mm. as small as it is, but it, it comes as 100%. Mm. You know, I don't have to sign a, a 10% deal with yeah. a certain court label, mm. you know. And uh, through our uh, uh, digital content creation, we have managed to close the gap between uh, entertainment industry and uh, the private sector mm. and government as well. Now we are able to advertise and be a, 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 a brand ambassadors mm. of big brands in South Africa. I've worked with Vodacom, I've worked to, I'm now currently Toyota. working with Toyota. Mm. And now uh, it makes it easier uh, for people to access uh, these uh, big brands. Mm. You know, now the big people are uh, abandoned out there. Uh, but feel like a true Toyota company. Yeah, hey, it feels because, personal. Yes, uh, now more than it would. They see one TV. of yes. their uh, representing. Mm. You know, I find in the advert in my bonnet TV. Mm. You know, uh, yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah, that's true. You see, so yeah, man. Um, uh, I'm, and I was also happy to get to see students here, mm. and um, I'm, I'm, I'm sure they will learn a thing or two. Mm in things that were said in presentations mm. that were done I was about here. to ask if you feel like these summits, you know, help because there are always conversations going around on social media where people will say, yo, um, you know, these businesses are investing so much money in organizing such summits, mm. but do they actually help, mm. you know? I think the, the most important investment you can give to someone is knowledge. Mm. Knowledge will empower you uh, to, to start creating wealth for yourself. True. Now, if you, you want to come here uh, with the aim, your Kongozela, mm. from these big companies that are here or Grants, Microsoft and loans, yeah, yes. no, those things are not going to be sustainable mm. you need to come here to get knowledge mm. on how you can sustain yourself mm. in the business space you that's know? beautiful, I yeah. like that that's true, um, you mentioned something earlier that it's very important especially as young people that we we use social media you know, for good I want to ask, as someone who's a public figure, who's also really, really big on Facebook, I'm sure you're one of the most followed South African um, celebrities on Facebook. Um, and by followed, I mean where you've actually built a community because there are yes, people yeah. with followings, but Kaubona, Aqua Interaction, yeah, you've yeah, got yeah. a literal community yeah. of people on Facebook. How are you able to... Um, and I'm sure with that also comes, um, you know, uh, critics and haters... I know Facebook is one of the Twitter light or tea, like, yes, you know. Yeah. How are you able to not give in to that? How are you able to be on social media and do what you have to do without minding the negative comments? Uh, one, uh, as, as as someone who, who who's a performer, I always need to 
have a sane mind mm. and uh, um, I need to always have uplifted spirit mm. you know so uh, I've created my team mm. it's my team we work together in dealing with every negativity mm. that comes or anything that yeah. needs to be put out mm. there so I'm a clash needs it might not be me personally who is dealing with those things mm-hmm. but someone in my team you know but uh, I I try by all means to disconnect to the uh, because you know social media can be a, a fake world mm. where it's not real it's, yeah, yeah it's, it's real think, but it's also, also not real life people love you mm. uh, you may think that people hate you mm. can they love you so mm. it, anything can anything. happen you know so now I always say uh, get your time. Uh, find who you are, mm. what you want, and whatever th- that you want to put it out there to people, mm. you know. So when when Usisa Indo Ebanduin, Uisa already know that even though I say I love you, I write I love you in my mm. timeline, there are groups that can uh, take that however take it in different mm. ways, you know. So uh, before you put it out there, you know you will stand whatever negativity that may come. Mm. And uh, I try, man, to protect myself. Mm. I'm protected because we're dealing mostly now with mental health issues. Mm. It's only because sometimes of the negative things that people uh, get on social media. We've seen celebrities uh, committing suicide because of the pressures they get from their fans, mm. from social media, and uh, out there in the streets. So, uh, to me, uh, if you with abandonments, you need your time. You need to surround yourself with people who will always uplift your spirit, who will always uh, be positive about yourself. If there's anything you know, I admire about you is how you you are. Like I'm meeting you for the first time, and one you're so calm. I don't know. Like you're very coming at you every day. Zoom. Upiko beti yoga. You're so calm, yeah. and you're yourself. You I'm, I'm myself. I'm like this. Uh, uh, people always say I have two characters. Mm. I have the stage character. Yo. When I'm on yeah. stage, um, I understand. Uh, and uh, I know others sometimes would mistake in that, but I know about there's an influence. Mm. There's actually no influence. Mm. Uh, I, I just become someone that I don't know mm. when I'm on stage. But off stage, I'm very shy. Mm. I'm very calm and collected. I love it personally. Calm. Mm. Uh, put as polele yo. Actually, we put as polele. I know try it. I know as polele. I polele can. Yeah. I like that. Do you never feel the pressure though? Um, you know how, especially as a celebrity. Um, how all these celebrities are just living lavish, you know? And as much as you're a celebrity, I also feel one with you. Like, I don't, I don't feel like you're different from us, you know? With celebrities, they live this life of God, you're fun in. Hey, yes, sis. I had one celebrity friend of mine, I won't mention him. Okay. Um, we had a discussion years ago. Mm. I don't think, uh, in fact, he was a big celebrity then. But uh, we had a discussion. He was there saying uh, he doesn't eat into a certain uh, type of uh, place, fried mm. chicken hey. shop. And oh I said, wow! Oh, okay. Is yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I asked. Are you telling me you don't eat for healthy reasons or mm. because you feel that? type of chicken mm. is a lower standard mm. for you. He said, no, I eat that chicken but I can't go there. I can't be seen, seen. by people on a queue buying that chicken. You understand? Now, I, 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 I said to myself, nah, all my life I want to be myself. 
Hmm. I don't want to fake anything. Or have to go to behind closed doors to be I, who no, I, I am. I can't. I can't. If if I'm able to to wear impatas, I will wear them. Mm. If I'm not, I will wear what I can afford. Mm. You know, as long as I look good, mm. uh, that's what is important to me. If I I I feel like going buying food from a certain shop, mm. I will go buy. I don't know if I can buy it. 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 Now, I can't be faking that life. Mm. Uh, when I was coming here, I was coming here to me. Service uh, uh, Monday. Okay. Up uh, young up home with service, and then I left with my friend going back to Mtada where I stay. So now I had to come to a summit. I have to come fetch my car with uh, service. You know, I took, I went to Ultra City, the Palo El, the High Candace Mount, <laughs> and people were so surprised. It takes many people. I go. It takes many. What happened? Ten. Uh, no, mm. my car is there. I've all, except for the cars, I say, the ND brand ambassadors, Zayazo, I do have my own cars. Mm. I've left them at home. I was dropped at hiking spot by my car. But now why should I spend uh, 2,000 Two rand on fuel? As on this is a month. When, when I, can just I can just take a hike at 200, this is up and take my car and get a month. Yeah. It's on wow. now it's like I'm I'm chasing status mm. out of a a, a, a convenience. Mm. Yeah, well. And you were comfortable, you didn't you weren't scared Dude, by, I was by comfortable and I connected with real people the whole two hours drive. Yes. People listening to the conversations I'm like it's like to say the privilege I make highs mm. and and I felt you no know, I've been disconnected to this kind of conversations. Mm. Just to feel no babandu. But it's not going to You know, when now, the more you think of a place, you buy houses in Windows, mm. uh, that makes you to connect, disconnect with the mm. reality. And they makes you, you now, how seems to be in you driving a car, you're no longer taking a taxi. Mm. Now, how seems to be in you driving a car, Good point of view, uh, 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 different from mm. people about pies and sabak mm. mamele, you know. Can you say that for a band? You know the kind of jokes I share on social media. It's the jokes that I know. No, everyone day to who's day. there, they will relate day to, to them day. because I'm not disconnected with those yes. people. I'm always around them. I live with them. Damn, damn, damn. Sorry, that is just you know. It's another. Powerful. It's another issue that artists always fall for. You know, when you are still an upcoming artist, writing music is influenced by mostly by environment you are surrounded with. Mm -hmm. That's why most people will write about their personal experiences. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> other people will write about things that are happening around them. Now, if you mm -hmm. are. If you if you if you are writing your music, the first album, out of your personal experiences and your environment, and then on the second album, after if S album yako say bumishile, why le big star, why mo tengi inkuku estate, what is connected with that reality? And you know abanya ban chamu obe pala ng life ya kisa le eka sen kuku indondo, palingo mangala life, and everyone can relate with those songs, and they buy that song, ne? And then now, when they buy the song, you become big. You go and buy into a uh, estate. Yeah. You live there now alone. There is nothing that inspire you me. to write music. You will write music about people of estate. How many people will live in estates? Yeah. Who now you find by artists from the first album, it becomes big. And then, mm. by since the SB, it yes. goes down mm. because people can't relate now mm. with what you are writing. Your about. music, even your prayers, if you're a gospel artist. I've been, me. I've been a traditional gospel artist. Mm. My success doesn't twist me from mm. being a traditional gospel artist. Mm. I told myself that if I have to go to America, if I have to go into Uzziah any West. continent, mm. 
they will ask me for who I am, for what mm. I stand for as a traditional gospel artist. Mm. I won't change and refine myself now uh, trying to be yeah. also trying to be yeah. uh, mm. you know, I can't. I myself, I have my own audience and that audience is waiting for the mm. message and the sound that mm. I can use. And if, I think, if people are going to enjoy you, let it be for who you are. Because yeah. what's the point of being loved and adored for being someone else? It can be an expensive yeah, fake. You won't keep up. You won't <laughs> keep up. Uh, speaking of music, music-wise, Connie Way, do you also feel the pressure? I'm on the chaos and the Fumene song of the year. So the <laughs> next thing has to still be, you know, uh, I be Koland. It co- always is about calling pressure. Uh, I've won a first song of the okay. year. 2014 yeah, the very first, yes. and that mm-hmm. song yeah, has kept yes. me for 10 years s- till I released mm-hmm. another song of the year which is you know, the one that was uh, yeah song of the year last year 20, yeah. you understand now it has been since 2013 mm-hmm. to 2023 it has been like a decade you know so all these years I've been trying I've been recording songs mm-hmm. you know but now uh, I don't record for, for song of the year or for mm. a hit. I record what I feel like it's the message that mm. needs to go out mm. there. I, I, I record to heal Yo. in this Yosa band. I record to entertain people. Mm. I record to preach the word of God. Mm. I record to preach hope to the mm. nations, you know. So if I was recording for a song of the year, I would be frustrated. If I was recording for hits, I would be frustrated. There are songs in Nazam. I meet with people and niggas a testimony. At I listen to Nyangele Mitawako and I, 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 I got so much inspiration and I was about to commit suicide. I listened to a song, Biako, you know, I get those testimonies. And those testimonies tells me, Ndoba, dude, uh, you might think this song, how you compare with the ones that have won mm. trophies and stuff. You may think this song is weak, <laughs> but this is the song that, that is powerful. To people, that heals to penetrate people. To people. Those and are the songs that make people plan city. Yeah. Mm. Even if we don't Nobody like this one, one. But, because but because of that oh, one, I will vote for him. That's beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Yo. I know one so of. So currently, I'm busy. I'm uh, doing my album. Mm-hmm. It will be released next year before Easter. Okay. And uh, also. That's w- before March. Yeah, okay. before March. So I was also doing uh, talent search around mm-hmm. Eastern Cape. Uh, so we've got like five artists in different regions. Mm. And those five artists were recording in January mm. uh, here at uh, Mire Makeba Studios uh, in partnership with Bomb Talent Search, in partnership with Toyota, mm. Vodacom, and also University of Forte. So we will also mentor these five artists the whole year next year so that they also become independent and also able to carry their own careers like I did on their own. Yo, that is so genius. Your man. It's like it's actually a huge deal you getting Vodacom, Toyota and these brands to come together yeah. because of you yeah. like they literally came together because of you yeah. that is yeah. your that and is huge uh, 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 also we're working with very well with a department of arts and culture mm-hmm. in the province okay. uh, they are helping us in in doing these campaigns this is inside because That's our aim That's is not we understand Eastern Cape is one of the exporters uh, mm. the talent uh, when it comes to music and acting. You go to your TV. Just right now, actually. You, know, you, see, you see now the Queenstown Queens are on number mm. one on, on Netflix. Netflix. And uh, uh, we have our own Kabeha, we have our own movies. Uh, there is another movie that I will, I will be featuring into. Okay. Uh, and when I looked at it through all the big names in the acting Industry. space, and mm. most of them, Gabala Pais mm. Cape. So I was like, it's, it's good now that we are bringing Joe back to Eastern Cape. Mm. What? We are building our own I decided I would never go mm. and stay in Joe. 
I will, I will create my music and build my career here in the Eastern Cape. Mm. So Lando Band be bigat be here la paba exploit. Now it's time we bring that thing here. Now it's a very kind of fully podcast design like mm. this, so that they they give platform to upcoming people mm. who want to advertise their talents. Yes. They give platform to uh, uh, upcoming businesses who can't afford to actually pay a TV ad, mm. but they can afford to pay an, a smaller ad in your podcast. So yeah, you know, speaking of which, we we are launching our podcast studios in Tanzania. Um, officially open to the public for you so you know young people and people who feel like they want to start a uh, podcast but they don't have the resources and um, uh, they can pull so through now you can to just come and rent the, the studio. space and yes do yeah. yes yeah, um, no, it's on the beautiful. 15th of December so if maybe umtata brings you to East London and you are free we would like to have you there and you know just pull through and launch with us and celebrate with us Thank you um, so much. I, 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 will, I will keep that. I will keep that. It's seventeen, sixteen. It's the fifteenth of 15th December. December. Yes. Okay. Thank you okay. so much. Um, oh, Bias Malel. Hey, hey Bias oh, Malel. Okay. I'm <laughs> God. Oh, okay. One minute and forty-two seconds. I'm sure you get asked this question a lot. Ne? Yeah. Uh, encourage But personally, one of the reasons I like to ask this question is that. Um, I don't think as people we can get enough of encouragement, you know, um, because one day you are on top of the world and the next day you yeah. feel like I'm yeah. in Don't Let Me yeah, Go Home. And, and uh, you know, even people who have everything mm. in terms of resources and uh, finances, mm. they need that daily encouragement yeah. because sometimes things may not be falling on the side of uh, msebenz mm. but emotionally we deal with different things mm. we deal with people who treat us badly mm. we deal with uh, uh, in in the sectors mm. that have in soft people who try mm -hmm. to sabotage our steps every day you know yeah. so uh, uh, we need that legal encouragement every day so i would like to say to someone uh, who's listening at home you can be whatever that you want to be in life and uh, always try by all means to strive for the best. Mm. But more than that, protect your inner peace, Ooh, protect your that. mental health, protect those people who are around you. Always mm. try to share love with people mm. and share whatever that you have. Mm. You can, you know, utando lumnani ngokba you don't need to give a person a million yeah. but if you give someone love mm. if you give someone respect mm. you are giving them Indo as a to stand the following day mm. thank That's you so much guys beautiful. for having me thank Nabulela you so much cool. Thank you so much. That was Mechisulum Kuinga live on the Naval Podcast. See you next time. Washa. <laughs>